Now, this one is long overdue. It's, bro, how long has the audio version for this came out? I don't even know. They Till they even, I think over two months. Two to one month. And then they finally made a video. And I said, brother, I ain't doing no reaction until I get the translation. My brother got the translation for me. I ain't gonna lie, I should have done this like two weeks ago, but it is where it is, isn't it? We got the translation. I don't want to hear the translation is not correct. God damn it, it's better than nothing. I appreciate it. You know what I mean? Appreciate someone hard work for once. They took time out their day to do this. You know what I mean? I can't speak Tagalog. Hard as hell. What the hell do I know? Eh. I think I only know the bad words. But then I can't say the bad words because then YouTube is going to yell out the videos. And at this level, I can't really swear on YouTube because apparently there's kids watching and stuff. But anyway... Floji, have Abby, Bugis, Bu, Bugis. He put in the translation. That's this word is actually coming from a French word, Bouge, bourgeoisie, bourgeoisie, whatever the hell he pronounced that, referring to those who are in the middle class and the upper class, right? We ain't doing no goddamn intro, no nothing. It's been long overdue. Let's go, bro. Got to turn it up. Man, you, bro, you <laughs> do you know how torturing it is? Listen before this even start. Do you know how torturing it is to have the strength to not listen to this song? You don't even want to know. One thing I see, bro. Hef Abby is so. I think the reason why he's getting all of this hype is because of his versatility. And a lot of his song that he's creating in uh, he's creating at the moment. Especially, I just dig my goddamn nose in front of the camera. <laughs> a lot of song that he's actually create in the um in his latest album. I've listened to two or something like this. They're so good, but I don't have no translation for it, bro. That's the thing. Do you guys want me to just listen to some of his song without no translation, bro? Or do you actually want me to wait? Because I feel like I hold this guy. A really good research. I feel like I'm not giving him the justice that he actually deserves. You know what I mean? I want to do it, but at the same time, I don't want to do it because it feels disrespectful. But Girls, I'm not going to be able to get the money. I'm not going to be able to get the money. I'm not going to be able to get the money. I'm not going to be able to get the money. I'm not going to be able to get the money. I'm not going to be able to get the money. I'm not going to be able to get the money. I'm not going
para sa mga negosyo bukas pa ay tayo pa Japan o kahit saan wag na rin maging pakibilin I ain't gonna lie I would love to go to Japan bro I think I'll say between Japan and China but bro it's just I'll go to Japan because of the fashion I think over there they take fashion very seriously and I like fashion in it I think oh, in Japan you go to Japan, bro. I swear to God, you come back, you start dressed differently. Them mouth, they can dress, bro. Like, yeah, I'll go to Japan for the fashion and for the food as well. It's actually a vibe, I am gonna lie. The two of them vocals combining together, Flo G on the low note, Hev Abby is there doing his thing. Two of them just literally gel like they've been doing this for years and they you know what I mean? Like they they feel like they're like a duo from they've been doing it for a long time. But it's just so authentic and real. I like that. <laughs> And you know what's crazy? <clears throat> I thought that this song was gonna have so many bars and lyrics in it. That's why I was asking for the translation. But I didn't even need the translation to understand what this song is about. I don't know, it's because I've been listening to Filipino music for so long. But the concept and everything that he says, I just put two and two together. And to be honest, the lyrics is just girl in it. I'm singing about how she's nice and what's it not and how she shines and do 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 but obviously it's good to have a deeper understanding meaning of music but there wasn't anything in there that I thought there was going to be punchlines and bars because when I see Flo G and Hev Abby I was thinking ooh oh my god this song is going to be disgusting but they literally surprised me Yeah. No, you know what's funny? I just listened to um Hell Mary. I just listened to Hell Mary and L James um Tequila Rose and this have a similar vibe even though <clears throat> they were, them them lot was more talking about some freak y'all stuff. L James and goddamn Hell Mary. This is more PG-13, but it's kind of a similar vibe, so, you know what I mean? It's good songs to listen back to back. I guess, yeah. But yeah. Biggest. Me. Stop. If you want to see me do more reactions like this, let me know in the comment section below. It's been your boy, it's been your homie. Peace.